hey youtube back with another video so i'm back with another walmart recipe so it's called apple gillet it's a little dessert so these are all the ingredients i got some butter some lemon juice tell me to get two different salts so that's what i got Shit, um cinnamon ground apple apple vinegar or cider vinegar whatever apple uh, cider um sugar whipping cream flour apples one egg and then you know my little my little two set so i'm about to make this little thing it says that it takes an hour for me to prep it and then 30 minutes to cook it so i will keep y'all updated um as i'm going through all of this stuff you know all of the steps or whatever so okay all right so step one i already put my uh flour in here i put my salt in here i put my sugar in here so now i just have to fluff it up with a fork it says so yeah all right so i gotta just mix this up i gotta mix it up with a fork so mix it mix it now after this gets all mixed up together then um it says I have to put some butter in here. So that's what I'm about to do. And it says mix that. Once I put the butter in here, it says mix that. And so I get like pea size or whatever. So, yeah. All right. Let me put some butter in here, child. All right. So I got my butter in here. It says eight tablespoons. So I got my um, eight tablespoons of butter in here. Now I have to mix this up. And it says into pea size. So... I'll come back when it's pea size, I guess. All right. All right. So now it's, you know, that's how I can get it. So I mixed up. So now it's telling me I need to put the apple cider vinegar in there. And I need to do it with my hand. So I need, I'm going to add one teaspoon tablespoon my bad one tablespoon of apple cider vinegar and mix it up with my hands then i have to put some cold ass water inside there as well and mix it up with my hands so i'll be right back y'all all right so i'm about to put that in here i gotta mix it up with my hands so let me use both hands i'm gonna use both hands all right y'all so this is how the dough looks i put the apple cider vinegar in there with some water <sighs> i'm just mixing it up now it says i would have to like mix it up into like put it like into like a little ball and then put like a um plastic over it and put it in the refrigerator for 30 minutes but chill it's a plastic it ain't saying no kind of plastic or nothing so i'm about to use this walmart plastic bag Cause yeah. Alright. That looks good. A nice consistency. They got shit on me, but Alright. Alright, y'all. That's how it looks. That's how the dough looks. I'll be right back. Alright, so now I got the dough inside the refrigerator for 30 minutes. So now I got to start working on the apple filling. So I got to cut up these apples. I got to use the lemon juice, the cinnamon, cinnamon and sugar. And I got to put it all in here for about 10 minutes. So I'll be right back. Let me cut, the, cut this up and I'll be right back. All right, y'all. I'm done cutting up all the apples. So now I just got to wait for this pan to heat up to get hot. So I can add it in, add this little stuff in and... Do my little do 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 again. This is the apple filling that I'm about to do, so yeah. All right, so I added the um, the apples to the pan, I added the sugar, the lemon juice, and the cinnamon. So now it says I gotta leave it in here for at least 10 minutes so the apples can get soft. And once the apples get soft, then I add in the butter. All 
All right, so I'll be back when it's done. Again, it's gonna take 10 minutes. So. So it's not done yet, but just letting y'all see how it looks with everything all mixed up. Okay, y'all. So this is how the um the thing looks or whatever. I was supposed to do it on a baking sheet, but I don't have no more, so I did it on aluminum foil. So and the apples are done it's very very much soft as hell so now i have to place the apples into the pan you see i have it for 425 and then i have to um stir up the eggs and what the one egg or whatever and wash it over so oh shit <laughs> all right so i'll be back when i got all of that in one pan all right so i think i put too much I think I cut up too much damn apples because I still have some in here. But it said brush the eggs over the little thing, so that's what I did. I put a little sprinkles on it, a sprinkle of sugar on it. So now I'm gonna have to put it in the oven for 25 minutes. Hopefully this thing come out right. I don't know if I did it right. Oh my gosh, I don't know. But I'll be right back. All right, so now I'm making a caramel sauce. So I mix butter, salt, and sugar. And so I gotta do that for three minutes. Cook this for three minutes or whatever. And I got to do it into like the sugar all dissolves. So I'll be right back. All right, so three minutes has passed. So now I have to add this, the heavy cream. And I got to stir that in there. And then it told me to remove it from the heat and let it um let it cool off so let me stir it up real good I wonder how this camera sauce is going to taste that off get from the heat all right so that's how the caramel sauce looks so now we just wait in on the um the little apples that's in the oven y'all i'm really about to fucking cry so i have like six more minutes left right <laughs> And I just looked in our oven, and it does not look like how the picture looks at all. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know if I want to show y'all. Like, oh, my gosh. I do not like baking. This shit is so annoying. Like, I can never get it right. Can never. I follow all the directions, and still, I don't, I don't fucking know. I don't know. I know one day I'm a, I'm still show y'all my fail. <laughs> I'm gonna still show y'all my fail, and then like one day when Josiah is um is available, stop. When Josiah is available or whatever, then um I'm gonna have him and make it and see how it come out when he makes it, cause he know how to bake. So. I'm gonna see how how it comes out when when, when he makes it, cause I don't know what the fuck happened, y'all. <laughs> all right, but I got like about six five more minutes until it's like all done. So, um, yeah, don't laugh at me, y'all. Don't laugh, <laughs> y'all.
This is not. <laughs> oh my goodness. I am so mad because. I really wanted to eat this thing because I was like, oh, this is gonna be good. No, no, this thing said, bitch, <laughs> I stopped baking. <laughs> okay, if y'all, if I show y'all, y'all cannot laugh at me. Don't laugh at me. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm scared. Okay. Look, okay. <laughs> Oh my god. I'm throwing it away. <laughs> I'm not even about to try it. Like, I don't know what went wrong. Like I don't I I don't know what went wrong. I don't I I don't know. I don't know. I don't I'm about to cry. <laughs> I don't know. I feel defeated. Oh my goodness. <laughs> but one day when Josiah is free, either during the week or on the weekends when he don't have to work, I'm definitely going to make him, because I still have some ingredients left over, so I'm definitely going to make him come in here and cook it and see if he gets the same results as me or better results, because he knows how to bake better than me. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Like, comment, subscribe. And don't share. <laughs> Oh my god, oh my god, I'm about to cry. Okay. Bye.